Most of the focus in the popular media and in the scientific press is, oh, they're eating too much, eating too much, eating too much, blaming fast food, uh, blaming sugary drinks, and so on. And there's really virtually no compelling evidence that that, in fact, is a cause. Those of us interested in science, public health, medicine, we have to learn how to get the right information out there. It's very clear that around the world, the populations are getting fatter. The big problem is we don't really know the cause other than, well, too many people are eating more calories than they burn on too many days. But maybe the reason they're eating more calories than they need is because they're not burning many. So we need to be in balance. We need to be in energy balance and at a healthy level, which means getting a proper amount of physical activity. We want to educate the world better on energy balance so that people have a better understanding of what it takes to maintain a desirable weight and, and so forth. And that's why we're creating, uh, in the early stages, we just got approval for the funding to establish a global energy balance network. So we need to discover what is really causing this epidemic and how do we change it? Well, we want data. We want actual data on energy balance, what happens over time, and then we want to communicate what we find in those studies to the world. Not just a few scientists that, that read some of our scientific journals, but to everybody. Teachers, university people, public health people, corporations, not-for-profits, etc. We want to reach everybody with this and help them better understand energy balance, healthy nutrition, healthy physical activity. Uh, we'll be reaching out to media, maybe offer a workshop on um, how do you understand, how do you interpret scientific research in the energy balance area. Help them learn how to become more knowledgeable uh, about the topic. I think we'll continue to do that. But it's the balance of intake and expenditure that prevents obesity, helps control obesity. We need to learn more about it. But with the network, we're going to get the information out.